Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Divine Empress. I come to do our daily messages. Let's see what's going on today. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm having a great day. Okay, let's see what's going on. Spirit, give me what I need for the collective. Give us our daily messages. Okay, Spirit is saying, see beyond your current, see beyond the current situation. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, see beyond your current situation. I was saying, hmm, because my cards, I don't know how they got upside down like this, but that's okay. Because you got happiness and joy coming, okay? Don't look at your current situation um, as the final destination again. And definitely be... Um, <laughs> Be a little softer in, in your stances and how you're dealing with people, okay? Be graceful in your movements. They want your spirit wants you to be the light. All right. Because you got you got happiness and joy coming. You got the emperor here. Take charge with authority. Take charge of your life with authority. Okay. I'm gonna get a few more. Get some extra messages today. Okay. Uh, spirit wants you to move in a new direction. And definitely, Spirit wants you to shift your percep your perception. Okay, shift your perception and see things from a different from a different level. You probably been you probably looking at your current situation like you know it's not things are not going to work out, but it is because you got the sun card here. You got the sun card, and you got spring at the bottom of the deck. This is see your seeds grow, and they got springtime. So springtime is very pr predominant right now. You got the you got the Lord. That's the uh, emperor, but this is also letting you know that um. This is also that you know that, you know, you take in charge, take charge, whatever the situation is, take charge with authority and make sure you do what you know you need to do for your life, period. Don't even, don't even think about anything else. Just take charge over the situation and do what you need to do, okay? Open up your heart, okay? Let love in and let yourself be loved, okay? Some of us, some of us we hinder our, our growth because we don't... We don't let people love us. Let's get some more messages. Let's get a few more. Spirit wants you to be the light, okay? Whatever the situation is, don't be angry. Don't be, just just be the light in the situation. Don't be so forceful, okay? Shift your your perception. You will see, you, it's gonna, it's some, there's some definitely good times coming for you, okay? So you're getting ready to move in a new direction. Spirit, give me what I need. Okay, so yeah, you got a home move or uh, a new job coming, mm -hmm. and it's going to usher in some positive new energies for you, okay? Yeah, it's going to be something dear to your heart. And Spirit is letting you know that you have asked God, you have got asked God and the angels and your spirit guides for help, and they're giving you uh, the help that you need. You're going to have all that you need. Spirit wants you to take some time out. Okay, you've been busy taking care of everyone else. Take care of yourself now. Communication, effective communication is very important right now. Spirit wants you to exercise and don't worry about anything. Um, you will have the money that you need, okay? Some money is coming to you. So don't be worried about the money. You're going to definitely get the money. They say Spirit wants you to have faith because God is in control of how that's going to happen for you. God, your spirit, guys, however, whatever you believe in, okay? All right, let's get some more messages. Spirit, give me what I need for the collective. Give me what I need. Okay, it says let go of a fixed plan. So if you have a fixed plan in your head, let it go. Okay, Spirit wants you to be spontaneous and let this and, and shift your perception. Okay, you got to shift your perception with this. It say you're being called into service, believe in your own guidance. That's why they say they want you to be the light. Mm -hmm. You're being called into service, and when you are uh, doing things, when you're being called to do things a little different and being called into service like this, it's pretty much saying that you got to be. You can't be so forceful with your moves and your actions and how you speak. So that's why um, they're telling you to be graceful with your movements and actions, okay? And Spirit is letting you know you are here for a purpose and you need to realize what that is. Realizing what matters to you. What matters to you? What is your heart telling you? And they want you to believe in your power to manifest and spend time on you to balance yourself. And that's why... Uh, 
Well, yep, take time out right here. Mm -hmm. Pretty much the messages are confirming. Take time out and balance yourself, okay? See with your heart. You got the heart, um, heart guardian here too. The time is now to hear the messages with your heart. And um, spirit was, you do have the heart card under here, the heart guardian card, pretty much telling you to let, let yourself be loved, okay? It's, you know, accept love and be loved, okay? They say time to do it differently, differently. Go beyond what you have done before, okay? So take it to a higher level for yourself, all right? Spirit got your back. Mm -hmm. You got some happiness and joy coming in as well. So just pay attention to these new beginnings because you got some new beginnings here. And it's going to be successful. But they want you to see with your heart. This is your heart. Your, some of y'all are probably blocking your heart chakra. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get some more messages to see what's going on. Spirit, give me what I need. Okay, okay, well. You do got the emperor here, but it's saying this is your twin flame. Whatever this is, it's saying it's your twin flame. What up, spirit? The yin to your yang. Okay, so you... Mm, I'm telling you, union people are coming into union. Um, communication. Uh-huh. Yeah, you got the communication card up there again. Okay, communicate effectively. You got passion. You got the yin to your yang. And spirit wants you to go outside of nature and let go of all doubts. Okay, let go of all doubts that you have. This person is dominant. That's why the emperor card is here. Whoever you, whoever your 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 twin is, y'all getting ready to come into union. What up, spirit? Just give me some more. Okay, what is this? Yeah, remove all doubt. Let go of all doubts. I just said that. Okay, between now and six months. Okay. What else? Spirit wants you to meditate. Definitely want you to meditate. Take some time out for yourself and meditate and figure some things out, okay? And keep up the momentum. Whatever you've been doing, Spirit wants you to keep up the momentum. And definitely, okay, you got the, okay, wait a minute. Oh, they just popping out, y'all, and I'm going to keep them coming. <laughs> okay, Spirit wants you to definitely eat some healthy foods, okay? Definitely eat some healthy foods. This person say they miss you or somebody miss you, okay? You got femininity. And you had the dominant card to come out. So this is divine masculine to divine feminine, twin flame, yin to yin yang. And you got yin to yin yang and twin flame right there too. Whoever this person is, they want to marry you. Spirit is saying that it might not be easy, but it's going to be worth it. <laughs> okay, it's going to be definitely worth it. And they want you to be accountable for your actions. Y'all definitely are mirroring each other. Okay, and somebody might end up getting pregnant. Spirit wants you to use your logic in your heart because some karmics are still around. Okay. All right. So let's get some more messages. Good gracious. That was a lot. I love that though. Spirit, give me what I need. Use your logic in your heart with this situation and definitely pay attention to these karmics. Now, it ain't just really just people. This is karmic situations in your life that's going to try to creep back up. I'm trying to tell y'all. Okay. Okay. So, but you do have love here. That's why Spirit wants you to open your heart, okay? Spirit definitely wants you to open your heart to this new love or new phase in love with your twin flame. Mm-hmm. Y'all are definitely mirroring each other. Somebody might get pregnant. That's why the sun card is here, too. Wow. Okay, I just noticed that. But no matter what you do, Spirit wants you to be the light, okay? What else, Spirit? Give me what I need, Spirit. Give me what I need. Okay. Foundation and achievements. Okay. This is this has something to do with your stability. Okay. But somebody is trapped in fear right now. You got to get out this fear. Okay. Because everything is going to be okay. Foundation and achievements. You're going to be stable. And you're going to achieve some big things when you and your partner come together. Even before you and your twin come together. What else, spirit? Your base chakra. Okay. Your base chakra. Pay attention. That, and this is how you derive money. This is how you make a living and take care of yourself on this earth okay you got you have new beginnings okay spirit wants you to rest and rejuvenate they keep telling you to take some time out for yourself and they want you to choose wisely because your wishes are getting ready to be fulfilled i'm gonna get a few more and we're gonna go to the major arcanas and we're gonna be done yeah your wishes are getting ready to be fulfilled that is so awesome you're getting ready to come into some truth about a situation as well give me what i need okay Right, there you go. You got the truth, okay? You got the truth. Spirit is going to... And this is the sun card again. Wow. 
This is the truth, okay? This is the truth of this whole reading. You getting ready to come into union and you getting ready to, you getting ready to have some happiness, joy, and success. You got positive movement forward, but you gotta take some time and go into solitude because you got some victory, you got victory and success here. That's what the sun card, this sun card was saying right here. Mm-hmm. Success and happiness. And you got victory and success. And you're gonna be reward that you got reward and recognition. But these karmics. There go the temptation right there. You got some karmic situ people or situations getting ready to try to come to you because you got some material harvest coming. You got to be careful because people are going to want to uh, come in and try to capitalize off your blessings. And try to, and if they're not trying to capitalize off of it, they're going to try to ruin what you have, okay? some oh, Look at the bottom of the deck. You got the sun card right there. Listen, you got some good things coming to you, all right? That's love. Very nurturing love. Somebody who don't mind giving love. What else, spirit? What else, spirit? Okay, somebody getting ready to take this leap. Take a risk on this love. Somebody's ready to risk it all. Okay, you got the queen of wands. Somebody's very passionate. And you got the king of wands. Wow. Okay, divine counterparts, twin flame, divine masculine to divine feminine. Both of y'all ready to take this risk. Both of y'all love each other. And y'all been manifesting this, okay? Y'all definitely been manifesting this. Spirit is here to bring justice to the situation. Okay, it's going to be marriage. Okay, but there you go with the devil. This person is attached to you. You attached to this person, okay? Might be um, some addictions here. Just be careful. You got the temperance card, okay? But this person might be also obsessed with you, okay? I'm, put, I'm picking up obsession, okay? What else, Spirit? What else, Spirit? Boom. There you go. You got new beginnings here. It is what it is. You got the Ace of Wands and the Sun card. This was at the beginning of the deck. Somebody's coming back around, but this also can let you know that your money is going to be good because you did have the money card. Okay. You got the Queen of Pentacles right here as well, and you got the Ace of Cups. This is a reconciliation with this King of Pentacles. Both of y'all going to be stable, grounded. Y'all love each other. Both of y'all going to be lucky together. Y'all compliment each other, okay? You got the star card and you got the chariot. Your wishes will be fulfilled. It is what it is. I love you guys and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.